All right, number one today. We're being asked to find the volume of a triangular prism. The other day we found the volume of a rectangular prism. Remember, triangles are just half of a rectangle. So we're gonna do the same thing with this triangular prism as we would do with a rectangular prism and then find half. So with a rectangular prism, the volume is equal to length times width times height. Now when we're changing that to a triangular prism, we're gonna take that length, width, and height and divide all that by two, all right? So the length is the long part, 12. The width is how wide the triangle is, eight. And the height, remember, is not the, necessarily the side of the triangle, but it's a vertical line going from the top to the bottom of the triangle. Sometimes if a triangle is a right triangle, the side of the triangle is the height because it's a vertical line. In this particular triangle, these sides are not the height because they're diagonal lines, okay? So the height here is three centimeters. So we're gonna do 12 times eight times three, and then divide that information by two. And that will give you the volume. And please remember, volume is cubed. So in this case, we'll have centimeters cubed. I know that's hard to write on the computer, but please remember that for the future. Good job, everybody. See you on the next one.